Hey, Dr. Berg here. We're going to talk about what's really behind liver spots, okay? Um, they're also called aging spots or solar lentigo. It's not really the liver. Now, if the liver is bad or dysfunctional, yes, it can create all sorts of problems with the skin. But if you have actual liver spots, um, it's coming from a vitamin C deficiency, okay? Vitamin C protects the skin from the sun. Okay, it's called photo damage or damage from the sun or light. So vitamin C protects the skin from the sun. The skin is um, collagen. The epidermis is all collagen. And vitamin C is highly involved in the formation of collagen. And if you look at some of the natural creams out there, they have serums for the skin to get rid of aging spots. What are they? They're vitamin C based. They, they work from the external though. You really got to work on the inside out, like consume the foods high in vitamin C, not necessarily just put it on the surface of the skin because it's going to come back the next time you go out in the sun. So as you age and you have the accumulation of sun and you actually have a vitamin C deficiency, the combination of that gives you these little brown spots. So why? Why are you vitamin C deficient as time goes on? It's either two reasons. Number one, you're, you're not consuming enough vitamin C. And I'm not talking about taking vitamin C as a supplement. Most vitamin C supplements are synthetic. They're made from ascorbic acid and they're made artificially from cornstarch and sulfuric acid. So especially if it's over like 100 milligrams, we know it's synthetic. Okay, it's artificial. It's not going to fix it. Vitamin C in nature is a complex of a whole bunch of different parts. Um, and so you want to get it from the food or a concentrated food. So vegetables, collard greens, cabbage, bell pepper, chili pepper, parsley, all those are very high in vitamin C. Large salads, high in vitamin C. Pasteurization, when they cook uh, vegetables, if you heat them, you destroy the vitamin C. So like orange juice, for example, has like not a lot of vitamin C because it's pasteurized. So, so that's one thing. All right. Now, number two, the, probably the more likely reason why you're deficient in vitamin C is not necessarily that you're not getting enough vitamin C. It's because of a condition called insulin resistance. This is in a lot of other videos I have. Um, but insulin resistance is a condition where your cells are blocking insulin because of too, much, too many carbs. Okay. And then what happens, or too many frequent meals, what happens, it sends a signal back to the pancreas and it tells the body to make more Insulin. So insulin resistance is a state where you're producing a large quantity of insulin, which then depletes vitamin C. Okay. In the presence of too much insulin, you're not going to be able to absorb or use vitamin C in the quantities you want. So you go out in the sun, you get this aging spots, liver spots, well, of course it's not the liver, and that's what's causing it. So if you want to correct it, don't use the external serums. Fix it from within and correct the insulin resistance and consume enough vitamin C. I'll put some links down below how to do that. But that's really what's behind liver spots. Thanks for watching. Hey, you probably already subscribed, but if you haven't, press this little button down below and I will keep you updated.